Hey guys, what's cooking? So are you guys having trouble making this jump consistently from top mid towards cave mid? So let me first tell you that what you see is not what you get. So therefore you can be as far away as here to land the jump perfectly. The same thing goes for jumping as well because you can be a very further away from the actual visible cues which you have. So this is going to reduce the units you have to jump in order to make the jump. The second thing which you should know is that you should not be touching the wall while you're making this jump. This may cause you to lose speed. Follow this line. This will help you make the jump much more consistently. And make sure you're trying to jump as late as possible. You can make the jump even way more early, but this is going to make your jumps much more consistent. So the first step is just running and jumping. So you just press your W key and you jump at the end. That's your first process. The second process is you do the same thing, but you let go of W after jumping and you move your mouse a little bit to the left. So you do that and you can see you're almost there immediately. Now the next thing you want to do is press A and control. So now you're jumping over here. And once you jump, you're letting go of your W key. You're pressing A and then crouching as well. And you'll see you land over here. This jump is actually quite easy. People overcomplicate it and that's why they miss it. You can be running from behind as well. Like you don't have to have a perfect lineup as well. As long as you're not touching the wall. And as long as you're strafing, you're always going to land this jump. As you can see, it's quite easy. And one more thing, you don't have to be running from so far away. You don't have to generate so much speed in order to go there. You can even be like jumping. I'll start from here now. And I'm still going to land this jump perfectly all the time.